Please, no more! <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton. I am your humble narrator. And welcome to Grav, an action survival MMORPG. It does have a lot of crafting, and the combat is not the greatest. There's Your right click doesn't even do anything, you just left swing to attack. You start out with just a knife and a resource extractor. There are lots and lots of buttons to get used to. It doesn't leave much room for key binding, unfortunately, unless you never want to point, dance, or give a greeting again. And you get some fossils together so I can make a club to hit people with. Not to go in as a middle-aged man and talk to teenage girls. Doop doop doo! Farming fossils. I really like the popping noise, too. It, it adds a really cool effect. Um, we need like 14 more fossils. Can probably get it from that over there. And then I will make a, a club. And it's gonna be called the No Girls Allowed Club. Except for the hot ones. Yeah! So now I'm bound with somebody's uplink, so when I die, I should always respawn here. And it's pretty cheap to relink yourself. It's only like seven or eight wood. Oh, get get the hell out of here. What are you doing? I think you walk up on me while I'm crafting. Rude. Just rude. Let me get some more wood and fossils and see if I can't build um, some armor. Mining a tree with a laser. Dude, that would be so legit if we could just cut trees down with lasers. Why don't we do that? Future lumberjacks? Talk to me. You know what it's like to be a spaceman without a gun? Dangerous. Wow, look at this. A giant blue ball that I can jump inside of. Woo! <laughs> Weird. Oh yeah, blueprint, baby. Harvester. Oh, that's the thing I need to farm the X crap that everybody's talking about. Why am I trying to hit that with my <laughs> club? I just had such a rust moment. <laughs> this is like space rust, basically. Albeit with less PvP. You can PvP, people just don't seem to. Probably because who cares? So you mashed, uh, your left click a couple times. Like, the combat's really not that exciting. It needs some serious work. But I love survival crafting. I love the premise. Just a little constructive criticism. The models and animations are really cool. For the characters and the enemies. Which I think is... Extremely nice. Let's we'll see if we can get to level 5 here. I hit you. I hit you again. And again. Blueprint! Level up! Oh, we got the Mark III multi-tool now. Come here, you! I ain't done with you. Okay, so now we've got some ridiculous wood gear, and we should be able to set up house somewhere. As soon as I decide where, it's pretty satisfying. I, I really do wish the combat was more complex, and that there wasn't such a grind in order to get the stuff, because it is really pretty. It offers a different environment. I haven't seen creatures like this in many other games before. Nope, you don't touch the quest giver. It's my quest giver. Naughty, naughty. All right, tree man, Stumpy. That's what I call you, Stumpy. It's pretty clever. A sparkle, a sparking medium bug dog. Oh, he doesn't take much damage. Beat him in the butt! Beat him in the butt! Drop! 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 Wow. 
couple blueprints. Generator and laser fence node. That's pretty cool. But again, probably have to find some more ore in order to build all that cool stuff I just found. Hey, bro. What are you doing out here, bro? More bug dogs? Get over here. Oh, these aren't medium bug dogs. I'd hate to see what a large one looks like. This is some good XP, tell you what. Stand there and take it. Can I come over here and go, what's going on, guys? Did you weaken you up real good? I hope so. I just walked in front of that head bash. Whoop. 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 Oh, God. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> the G and the H are right next to each other. Ah, uh, generator and automated gun turret. Oh my god, that's awesome. Let's get out of here. Okay, so here is some element X, and I'm going to attempt to build an extractor on top of it. B for the crafting menu. Placed items. Harvester. Do it. Nice. Lock it. Oh, fantastic. So this is my first harvester. Oh my god, I could have built it in a really bad place. So we'll try and get a house together real quick. Just so I'm not smashed a little later. Room with door frame. Well, that sounds fine. Awesome! My house! My little room with door frame. <laughs> so I guess this will be like one of my respawn stations. And I'll build... Powered. Ooh, look at all this. What? When powered, we'll target and shoot foes nearby. Cool. Let's make uh, the armory factory and science station. Oh, I need a lot more wood for the armory. Well, we could start with the factory. You leave the wanderers alone! Leave them alone! I didn't mean to do it. <laughs> I killed him! I have no stims left. Oh, fart. We gotta go. Oh. No! Stop! Please! I've had enough! Please! No more! So this has been Grav, ladies and gentlemen. It is a little bare bones at the moment, but it is an early access and hopefully everything will be fine-tuned and ready for a full release. I did enjoy myself, however, some parts are kind of frustrating, namely the combat which you don't want to get into, and then the, the penalties for dying is basically most of your stuff getting dropped, which is pretty harsh. I mean... There's not a lot of other players to kill you, it's not as bad as something like Rust, let's say. But it definitely might turn some people off, myself included. I will give this game a 6 out of 10, just because I believe it will turn into something good. It has a lot of great ideas and potential. I just want to see it develop a little more. So I will come back and review this review when that time comes and the game has a full release. Until then, 6 out of 10. This has been Grav, ladies and gentlemen. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Until next time, friends. Bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. 
Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends. 